Yeah. Marla and Alex, two of Kennedy's sons reportedly supported the release of Sirhan Sirhan, and so does a former colleague of ours who was there that night that Kennedy was assassinated and was the first on the air to report it. How much more can you punish the guy? That's former reporter Tim Harrell, who was there the night Sirhan Sirhan shot Senator Robert F. Kennedy just after midnight. Kennedy had just been declared California's Democratic nominee for president and was walking through the kitchen of L.A.'s Ambassador Hotel. Boris Yarrow talked to Hal Eisner for a KTTV special about the photo he took marking that moment in history. First clue I had something not right was shots. Bang, bang, bang. Yarrow died last year. Fox 11 reached out to Kennedy's son, Robert Kennedy Jr., for reaction to the parole board's decision to release Sirhan. In the past and for this hearing, he supported his release. He refused a request, but again, in our KTTV 70 special, his memory of the moment he heard his father was shot. Somebody told me that my dad had been shot. But at that point, I thought he was still going to live because he, he felt indestructible to me. And then I heard my mother's, um, one of her sort of deputies saying um, that giving the order to close all the campaign headquarters, and that's when I thought, you know, my dad's not going to make it. Harold's reaction to the parole board's decision is one of forgiveness. It might be difficult for him, but I don't see any reason to keep the man incarcerated. I mean, this is, you're not talking about, you know, somebody that's a repeat offender that has a long rap sheet. Harold calls himself a fan Please. of Bobby Kennedy and speculates on the kind of president he could have been. And I believe Kennedy would have gotten us out of that war beforehand. So I, I enjoyed Kennedy. Of course, there's still a process for Sirhan Sirhan to be released from prison if the governor signs off on that. Where will he go? Well, we do know that he has a brother that is still alive and living in Pasadena. Reporting live in Santa Ana, I'm Susan Hirasuna, Fox 11 News.